How do you? I'm I'm just hey guys, it's Ro. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm hanging out with my sister, Mo. Hey, everybody. Trader Joe's dropped all of their holiday trees. Molly and I are gonna be trying all of them. And we're gonna be telling you which ones are our favorite. Are you ready, Mo? I'm ready. Yes. Let's do this. Let's do it. So Molly grabbed these ones immediately. She wanted to try them first. Oh, they sound delicious. Are you kidding me? We love Trader Joe's. It yes. has nicknames in our house. I don't know about you guys, but we call it TJ's, Trader J's. It's usually just TJ. Yeah, we love some <laughs> TJ's in this love. house. These are mini dark chocolate mint stars, and they are minty chocolate shortbread cookies enrobed in TJ's dark chocolate. is on it, you guys. I feel like I'm gonna take these with me, actually. So. Literally, Molly's so crazy about her dessert. She's <laughs> lactose intolerant, and she takes lactose pills so she can eat all these. I'm about to take some. Let me tell you, you can't stop a stubborn Italian woman. I've got my first star. Oh, <gasps> they're so cute. Look at the size. Just Ugh. teeny, cute, little bite size. And they have like the little, um, non perials. Non perials. <laughs> Molly, good job. <laughs> Cheers to our first holiday treat. Mmm. Mmm. These are so mm. good. They kind of mm. remind me of those little Andes after dinner mints, mm -hmm. but with like a little shortbread cookie in the middle. It has a little bit of the crunch from the shortbread Yum. cookie. And the non perials do add a little bit of crunch, but these are like, like I'm taking these home. You guys, mm. these are a win. It's like the right amount of mint too. It like lingers yeah. a little bit. And I really love a dark chocolate, you guys. That is a beautiful blend. We love it. Two we thumbs up in this Eight house. thumbs up. Whoa. Everybody put their thumbs up. That's everybody in the room. Okay, so do you you pick this one, I'm gonna pick the next one. Just for the record, everybody. Everybody loves it. I had a couple friends reach out who said they'd come try treats with me today, yeah. but Molly goes, no, I'm doing it. No. No. It's gonna be me. You can't stop her. It's gonna buy my. <laughs> <laughs> So Molly picked her favorite. Now I'm gonna pick what I think is gonna be my favorite. I love English toffee. How old are you? <gasps> oh my, oh my god! English toffee is your favorite? Okay. Chop sprinkled with chopped nuts. <laughs> I have the same taste as our grandma, and she had great taste, Molly. <laughs> Valid. Okay, older and wiser. Okay. There's a reason. You get that, older and wiser. Oh, that toffee with chopped nuts. <laughs> Okay. Well, now that my sister has made me feel like I am 200 years old, <laughs> I'm just excited because you can get the big tin of them at Trader Joe's, or you can get these little, little snack size. Little snack size. Put it in your lunch. Look how cute. I'm gonna keep these in my purse because just like my grandma, I am starting to keep candies in my purse. Oh, oh look at that lid. Okay. This is like when you open a soda can. Yeah. Ready, ready, oh, here it goes, here it goes. Okay. These are so cute. So they're little English toffees and then they have so little good chocolate, little size. nuts. Okay, let's do it. Okay. I love them. Okay, those are pretty good. Three of these, only 200 calories. <laughs> oh my God. What else is 200 calories? I think apples are like, what, 100? Are you kidding? Apples are like 70. Same as a banana's more like 80. Wow, so that's like three bananas. Yeah, but would you rather have a banana or one of these for dessert? Okay, these are pretty good. These are amazing. Maybe eat sparingly, but two <laughs> thumbs up, Molly. I will give it to you. Those are pretty good. All right, we have got some mini gingerbread people. I like how inclusive that is. <laughs> We love a good gingerbread. That smells like Christmas yeah. in my house. Oh. oh, he's missing an arm. Oh, oh there we go. There we got go. here. Oh, okay. Well, th this box looks like it got a little beat up in, in shipping. All right, so we've got a little gingerbread cookie. So cute. Pretty cute. Yeah, and he's got a little face design. They got a little eyebrows bow. even. And on the back side, look at that. It's like a little icing. It smells real good. It has the gingerbread oh. flair there. This is what's up. Mmm, crisp. Crunchy, mm. all those spices. I'm getting a lot of the Cinnamon, spices. Nutmeg. Yeah, strong spice. Ooh. Mm. These are a little spicy. It does There's have a little heat. kick. The ginger is a little strong in this. So these are really gingerbread little cookies. Okay. Truly ginger of gingerbread. These are great. Okay, you can take those home. I'll take the. I'll I take am the, home I'll and I am going to keep them here, Molly. Mo, you know what time it is? What time is it? It's time for Jingle Jangle. Oh, That's jingle, what jingle, time jingle. it is. Oh, Jingle Jangle reminds me of that song. You know, what is that? What? Jingle bells? 
Wait, so, Molly tells me her impressions of songs <laughs> or accents. I can never guess it. Her impression for Arnold Schwarzenegger is not the best. Like, I'll be back. She goes, I like cookies. And I was like, Cookie Monster? Like, what? What it are was, we saying? It, it, it's another quote. It's just okay, not no. his most famous This reminds quote. me of the show Riverdale, based on the Archie comics. If you guys love Riverdale, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. The code word for like somebody selling drugs is like they're selling that jingle jangle. jangle. Okay, this is that no, jingle, jingle jangle. jangle sounds like a Christmas movie horror villain, like Mr. Jingle Jangle. Mr. Jingle Jangle. All right, well, let's try these treats. Topped with candy-coated dark chocolate gems. Gems. m and ms And JoJo Cookie Bites Oreos. Okay, so these are much bigger than I expected. These are huge. All right, here we go. Okay. They taste good, but they're a little dry. It's a little dry for me. And you don't get salt. I think that's a pass for me. This one's gonna have to be a pass for me because with so many wins, this one's Not just top favorite. pretty dry. You save that jingle jangle for Riverdale. Riverdale, take your jingle jangle and get the heck out of here. <laughs> Mo, what you got for me? An assortment of boozy little chocolate <laughs> truffles. All right, yeah. spirited chocolate. Get spirited into chocolate. the holiday spirit for real. We have a London gin, a scotch whiskey, a navy rum and a Prosecco. Oh, these are cute. These are nice and bite-sized and little. They're it's not teeny. like you can just have one. You can have like one of each. Cheers. Oh. Mm, wow. Wow. Oh, I think that's a pass. If you are a chocolate lover, you may love these. You might like these a lot. Mo, I don't know about you, but I also didn't taste a lot of alcohol. These kind of remind me, do you remember those little desserts where they're shaped like little alcohol bottles? No. And it's chocolate, what? but on the inside, it's a little bit more boozy. Oh. And, and you really taste the booze in the chocolate. That's what I thought these were going to be like, um, but they're not, you guys. Very I'm... light on the booze and very, very sweet. Well, it's too sweet. <sighs> okay, Woo! you get to pick the next one. Molly? Let's go nuts. <laughs> Haven't we already? <laughs> All right, so these are candy cane chocolate covered almonds. Okay. I love when they coat them in chocolate, but these are candy cane, so they're like peppermint bark covered almonds. Interesting. Peppermint is such a classic flavor for the holidays. There's gingerbread, there's nutmeg, there's peppermint, there's eggnog. All of the yummy things. Whoa. They're not as crunchy as I thought they'd be. Barely tell that there was an almond in there. You're getting a lot of chocolate, a lot of mint, very little almond. Like I thought these were big almonds, but here, let's cut this open. You could just bite it, right? Oh, oh, that's a Look, decent amount of almond. It doesn't taste like that. You don't like taste that. it. You taste a lot of the chocolate and the peppermint, but the mint in my mouth, not overpowering. It's a nice amount of mint. I wanted more crunch, but they're good. Look, here, see if I can do this. Where you go? Why <laughs> <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> I think I heard that. <laughs> this is why my sister is MVP and I'm the mascot. <laughs> <laughs> Good. I like them. They're not as not crunchy as I like, but punch, I like them. And they're, they're okay. pretty sweet. They're okay. A great idea. And next up, we have these cute little hot cocoa bears. They're so cute. He's a hot cocoa polar bear. <gasps> I love these. Do you remember when we made hot cocoa bombs from yes. scratch? Yes, they and were delicious. And they were huge on TikTok that year. They blew up everywhere, and now you can find them in stores everywhere. And they're not only just the traditional circle bombs anymore, but mm -hmm. look, they're making them big. Shade. Confection filled with milk chocolate drops and marshmallows. So there's marshmallows Ooh. inside of the bear. And it says, rich and sweet, warm and cozy, Trader Joe's hot cocoa polar bear is cute as it is delicious. I can't wait. I want to see what's inside of it. My little bear. Okay, let's open them up and we'll get some hot oat milk. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Yes, you can hear him. There he is. He's so cute. And he goes Whoop. into the hot milk. Okay. Ooh. Oh, it's like I'm drowning. Oh my god, this is a little terrifying. Okay, that's like kind of dark. That Santa wouldn't like. Oh, uh, right? okay. <laughs> oh, oh, he, he just said it fell off. His head fell off. Here's all the little cute marshmallows that came out. But here's what's kind of disturbing: his head <laughs> melted off. This does not give me a warm holiday spirit. I feel like we just made the naughty list. <laughs> <laughs> I know. 
cocoa looks red. It doesn't look like that beautiful milk chocolate brown with marshmallows on the top. I do like the idea of these. I love the little yeah. mini marshmallows in there. It's just, it didn't look like this. It, it didn't, didn't look like a polar bear taking a steam bath. This looks like you're, you know, at the spa. You're in a hot tub and you're just cozy. You're just melting into your okay. hot cocoa. Okay. And I was like, oh, that's so cute. It felt a lot more violent. I don't love that it's like kind of red. Okay, I'm gonna give it, it a go. It smells let's, really let's... sweet. It smells like really sweet. Oh my gosh, that is sweet. So sweet. It's a little too sweet. Woo! Whoa. It's a little too sweet for me. Adorable, mm. love the idea, but whew, that's a pass for me. Okay, Molly, I've got another drink for us to try. Let's try a different hot cocoa. Here is something a little similar, but different. These are so cute. I love seeing these at the store. They're hot cocoa stir sticks. And this one says it's salted caramel hot love cocoa that. stir sticks. It even has little mini marshmallows on there. This is so cute. And I don't think you have to deal with heads rolling off. I think this would be a lot easier. And it even comes with the spoon to stir. I have high hopes for this one. All right, so I'm gonna heat up our hot oat milk. Great. And then we're gonna give it a go. In we go. Whoop. Oh, I love this. I'm stirring my tea, you know. To be fair to this product, I didn't heat the milk hot enough. It's warm, but it's not hot. I mean, most of it's melted. So it All is mostly mar the melted. Are... The marshmallows are floating, but let's take a sip, Molly, yeah, because it's basically good. all melted this off is of good. here. It smells really caramely. Oh yeah, you could smell a caramel. Oh, that's too sweet for me. Oh, that's I again, love that's that. too sweet. Okay. Okay, it's less sweet than the bear. Definitely. I enjoy this, but I do think they could cut back on the caramel just a little bit. So whoever makes these at TJ's, I love them. Maybe yeah. just tweak the recipe next year. I like this. This one was a good one. Okay, there you go. Mm -hmm. You can have mine. Here you go. I will. You I'll can... take them both. I love caramel. It is time for a classic favorite at TJ's. These are the dark chocolate covered peppermint JoJo's. So it's basically like an Oreo, but they cover them in dark chocolate with a little peppermint, peppermint bark, and people love these. I'm so excited to try these them. I've are... had JoJo's before. I've not had these before. Ooh! Da -da -da. Wow. They kind of remind me of like thin, like a thick Thin Mint. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah, instead of a Thin Mint, it's a Thick Mint. These chunks are pretty big. Like, yeah. these are pretty big chunks of candy cane. This isn't little. This is... They're not joking around here. Kind of heavy duty. Okay. Why is this as big as like a double stuff? Ooh. This is like a double stuffed. Truly. Oh, you guys. Wow. They're good. Wait a minute. Oh my God. This is like if you wanted the stars, but like a little heartier. These are like it's like a step up. Girl Scout Thin Mints with a little bit more chocolate. With a holiday they twist. These truly are Girl Scout Thick Mints. <laughs> if you like Thin Mints, you are gonna love these. I agree. Wow. 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 Delicious. These are the Thick Mints. They taste just thick like mint. it. A delicious. Oh, yeah. When? When? Let's try another cookie. I just love, during the holidays, the cookies come in tins. Does it look like a little drum? Yes! <laughs> a little drummer. <laughs> okay, but anyways, these are Danish butter cookies. And yeah. I love butter cookies. Okay, and you got a couple they're different simple, kinds. They're crunchy, they go really good in the morning. I like to have one with like a little coffee. Ooh, okay. Just for the holidays. Whoa! Oh, I love this. Oh, these are oh, cute. Oh, you have five oh, yeah, different look, types. Look. They all have different designs. Some are plain and some are topped sprinkled with a little bit of sugar. Look at this. They're in the little cupcake liners, little treat liners. I already so have a bite. Cute. And it pretty much was crunchy and melted in my mouth. <gasps> Just butter. And it was wonderful. Just a buttery cookie. You mm -hmm. can't go wrong. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Crunchy and buttery. They're great. I gave it a win. It just it just melts in your mouth. It's delicious. Let me try one of these with a little sugar one. Sugar on top. Okay. A little sweeter. A little mm. sweeter. Yeah. Same, but just a little crunchier. We love it. Simple, iconic, delicious. I approve. And we have peppermint cream. We have a lot of peppermint this season. This is what I'm imagining, Molly. They're like junior mints, only yeah. big. Oh, oh, okay. They're senior mints. Not junior, they're senior. Okay, here we go. Oh, Molly. And the crushed candy cane on top is the same as the JoJo's. This is looking promising. Let's break one open. Let's see what's inside. I really want to see this. 
Oh, it is. Oh, it is. You guys, mint. look at the gooey. Look at the gooeyness. It is a Jumbo Junior Mint. This is a Mama Mint. If that's your jam, if this is your candy, this is your holiday treat right here at TJ's. Mm. Oh, that's oh. wonderful. Delish. Mmm. Mm -hmm. mm. A Big Mama Elevated Junior Mint. Look how cute this is. It's a little this present. is an Italian cake and it's wrapped like a little present. This is a panettone cake. Now usually the Italians, they're like fruit cakes for mm -hmm. the holidays, but this one specifically says it's a chocolate one. So cute, you guys. If you've never had one, try it. So let's do it. Ready? Here, okay. here you pull outside. One, two, three. A panettone. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Molly. Okay, wow. there she is. I like TJ's. Thank you for bringing some oh. Italian treats into your stores. This is making Ooh. my heart happy. Oh, I'm getting so excited. That smells so chocolate. Oh, let me smell. Okay. Let me smell. Oh. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, 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 oh yeah. So there's oh, a yeah. lot of powdered sugar. Like, what are you doing? This You're is... supposed to sprinkle it. You just look, dumped it on look. there. What have you <laughs> done? Molly's not the baker in the family. Listen. I'm not. <laughs> yeah, we can tell. Oh, look, look at the fluffiness. I think you're supposed to peel the paper. Whatever. Okay. <laughs> I'm not even gonna wait for you. Look at Just this, you guys. Dig in. It's so soft. It's like, so like soft. buttery croissant soft. It's not flaky, it's more moisture and oh, yeah. soft, but it's just that same, all of those buttery layers. Oh my goodness. Here, I don't even need the fork, but you know I'm gonna do it. Mm. That's good. Melts in your mouth. You need a holiday dessert? Pick up one of these puppies. I'm, this surprised Delicious me. Delicious recipe. This is bomb, you guys. Okay, I can't stop taking bites and we still have more food to try. Also, don't be like us, okay? Take off the paper liner <laughs> before you make a cut because otherwise, disaster strikes. And use a, use a sieve. <laughs> a sieve. <laughs> a sieve. A sieve. A sieve, right? Same thing? Potato, potato? Let's go get another treat. Okay. Continuing our international treats, we have some German cookies. Now, Molly and I are both a quarter German, mm -hmm. and I absolutely love German pastries. They are so good. These little cookies we found at Trader Joe's are called Lebkuchen. We have a huge community of bakers, of fans in Germany, so much so that we even made our cookbook. We translated it into German. I can't tell you how much I love you guys, and I love your baked goods. It's for you. Oh, they're kind of light. They're kind of like oh, they're... crispy. It smells really good. They smell bomb. Oh my gosh. They're like fluffy and airy. It's kind of like a gingerbread spiced whoopie pie with nuts. Little teeny, look little at teeny these. nuts. I can look taste the little nuts. Teeny little nuts in there. This is delicious. This is really good. Wow. Mm. I don't know what I was expecting, but I really enjoyed this. I also think it's the perfect balance of sweetness. Mm -hmm. It's not too sweet, mm -hmm. and the nuts in here give it that little nuttiness. It really a little extra it, texture. It, yeah, too. it grounds it in your palate. Mm -hmm. These are delicious. They are a win, for sure. Two thumbs up, you guys. The next treat we have a classic. Mm -hmm. It's a candy cane, but it's a jumbo handmade candy cane, and there's a fun twist, Molly. With a cocoa cream filled center. There's chocolate on the inside, you guys. So it's like chocolate peppermint. I don't know if I love that. Really? I mean, we'll give her a go. We'll give her the benefit of the doubt, but I don't know if I'm I into just that. love this. How do you? I I'm just, okay, Molly, just pull it. Like, oh, geez. I got crazy there. I just want to get to it. Oh, it's not gooey chocolate. It's like a hard chocolate. Let me see her. Oh, yeah, I don't like that. What are you doing? Oh, oh. Not right? It's not right. <laughs> it's not right. Oh, 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 no, I licked it. That was enough. I don't feel what I'm tasting. This ain't it. But this, this, no. No, this is a pass. No. This is a pass. Okay, I have way bigger more, hopes. More peppermint, you guys. And pretzels. These look delicious. They're peppermint pretzel slims. Thin, crunchy pretzel slim with a Ooh. candy coating and peppermint sprinkles. Love this. That sounds wonderful. Those are all my favorite buzzwords. Sounds We're into it. Balance. We are into it. Good. Look at these. <gasps> these are more bite size. Okay, Check these are out. so cute, you guys. Yeah. Look at this. Yeah. They're small and they're real thin. We love it. Oh, oh, oh like let's that. try it. Ready? Okay, ready? For the crunch. Yeah. That's this good. This literally just tastes like peppermint bark. You know how if you do crushed up so good. This is the pretzel to do. Mm -hmm. I'm it's into a these. little heavy on the uh, dipped 
chocolate coating because the pretzel is very thin. Mm -hmm. But they're phenomenal. These are good, approved. Thumbs up. These are a great holiday treat. Mm -hmm. Since we haven't had enough peppermint today, I thought we would try one more. Last one. The classic peppermint bark, and we can see how it compared to the thin peppermint pretzels. Ooh, I like what you're saying. And these ones come in a cute little metal tin, mm -hmm. which I love. And it says here that these are old fashioned and handmade peppermint oh. bark. Peppermint infused dark chocolate. Okay. White truffle fudge atop pure perfection, no objection. Okay. This is the thickest peppermint bark I've ever tried. Let's give it a go, Molly. Ooh, I just like some straight up solid chocolate. Tastes delicious. I love the crunchy texture on the top. The chocolate paired with the peppermint. Mm -hmm. Great flavor pairing. I'll take the pretzels. Those pretzel thins were Yeah, it. the pretzel thins were my favorite. If you like chocolate and you like peppermint bark, this could be for you. It was just a little too much for me. So my feedback, Trader Jays, if you make this thinner, winner, winner, chicken dinner. Love it. Here is the last festive treat that they had at Trader Joe's. And this is so cute. It's an assortment of chocolates. So depending if you're a chocolate lover, it has a little bit for everybody. They have oh. milk chocolate, white chocolate, dark chocolate. Then they have hazelnut, caramel, and creme brulee. Whoa, that's Ooh, fancy. Ooh, I want to try the creme brulee. I love creme brulee. Molly, cheers to our last treat. Cheers. Oh, wow. That's really sweet. It's really, really sweet, and it's so creamy, and it's too sweet for me. I love it's sweets, like really but it's sweet. too sweet. Adorable, but just too sweet, but I love it, but it's too sweet. All right, that does it for the video. We tried all of the treats <laughs> from Trader Joe's that came out this year. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video, and a big thank you to my sister Mo <laughs> for hanging out with me today and trying all of these. Well, thanks for letting me come on. That was delicious, and so I have some good. new favorites. So Mo, what was your favorite treat? that we had today. I think it was the one we started with. The dark chocolate mint stars. I loved those. I would eat a whole box of those. Oh, they were I'm so obsessed. good. Oh, but I love that cake too. That I love the me. Italian really cake. I really loved the cake. And I loved the thick mints. <laughs> oh, the thick, thin mints. And those German cookies. The German cookies were good. And I hope you guys found the video helpful. So when you're out like shopping for the holidays and want to try some treats, you'll have some idea of what to get. We're foodies in this house and we love the sweets. So love we them. love to share all this kind of stuff with you guys. If you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, click subscribe, it's free, and ring the bell to receive notifications every time we post a new video. And if you want to watch any other videos, you can click up here. Or up here. Right here. All right. Ready? 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 A jingle? A jingle. A jingle. <laughs>